Video shows the final moments before an Austin woman was found dead in a Nevada jail. Her friends and family say her death was preventable. Now the family is suing, claiming authorities ignored her calls for help. KVU's Kaylin Norwood spoke to the woman's friend who says watching that video was horrifying. Kaylin? Well, Mike, she says Coltrane was addicted to drugs and died of a drug related seizure, but family and friends are claiming jailers did nothing to save her life. Her best friend told me watching that video a year later is bringing back a lot of emotions. One of the most outgoing people I've ever met, always just trying to make people laugh, make people smile. Funny, smart and the life of the party. Just a few words Katie Andriano uses to describe her best friend of more than 10 years. The hardest part of it all is thinking about how she was feeling. She's talking about the final moments before Kelly Coltrane died in a Nevada jail. Video the family's lawyers gave us shows the 27 year old in her cell buried under blankets, not eating and appearing to shake. The jailer reportedly asked her to mop up her own vomit. She's believed to have died an hour later with deputies not realizing she was dead for at least five hours. You know, it was all horrifying, but the most horrifying part was just imagining my best friend being alone, dying and not having any help. They gave her no medical care whatsoever. She asked for it. There's a hospital across the street that's supposed to be providing medical care. And they even they even expressly told her that she doesn't get to decide when she goes to the doctor. In a lawsuit filed last week, Coltrane's family says when she was arrested, she told Mineral County deputies she was drug dependent and had a history of withdrawal related seizures. She asked to go to the hospital, but the family says the deputy refused to take her. Now the family is fighting for the creation of new policies in hopes of saving someone else's life. And this isn't about people trying to get rich. This is about trying to prevent this from happening to somebody else's kid. Coltrane was in Nevada visiting family at the time. Before her death, the family's lawyer says Coltrane was working on getting her massage license and talked about going to nursing school. Quita? Kaylin, thank you.